I've no idea what the founder of the Church of the Crystal could be plotting, but... It's clear that you were the one who arranged the alliance between Horn and Fennis. That's why... I'll start by killing you first! Brainless slug. Do you think you can match the likes of him? You never know until you cross blades! Oh, this is gonna be fun! Have at it then! I'm looking forward to seeing just what this Sodaly is capable of. Watch your mouth, Ryu! Don't say I didn't warn you. M Master. <laughs> Quite strong, this one! Yes, and yet... True. Beheading the enemy leader here would certainly turn the tables in our favor. A fight I can stake my life on. It's certainly been a while. <laughs> Sorry for dragging you into this, Master. No apologies needed. I should be thanking you for bringing a little excitement back into my life. These people are not to be harmed. Understand. Are you mocking us?
in a favorable mood today. I will show you something special. The essence of magic! Most excellent. The rumors were not untrue. If anything, they did not do you justice. <laughs> I've barely broken a sweat. Suddenly, you're next! What the? What is it? What's happened? What? Elda sprung a surprise attack? The first pursuit force got sidetracked in a battle? Who are you talking to? It takes getting used to. I was surprised the first time as well. He's got some sort of device for speaking with those who are far away. Good for giving orders and such. Another ancient relic. If he can give commands to those out of earshot... I think we just discovered the secret to Moraga's power. Elda. That rat. Ambushing us when I thought he was resting in the village. That sounds like brothers. Mon's tactics, all right. What are you saying? That even with such a powerful relic in your possession, you weren't skilled enough to wipe out Leonis. <sighs> if I'd been in command, Elda's reign would be over. You would take King Elda's life? Is he not your own father? That callous man is no father of mine! Not only did he abandon me, but he abandoned his own wife, my mother, to save his own damn neck! My sword is yours, Moraga. It will prove more useful than that washed-up shinobi Ryu ever could! Who the hell do you think you are? You think I'd fall for that, do you? You believe that I would betray you? I'm afraid it is I who bears full responsibility for this situation. I simply propose an alliance between Horn and Finnis, so as to resist Rundal to the west. Alas, where have I erred? By what manner of fate did it come to this? Allow me to step in, and perhaps I can effect some sort of reconciliation between you and your father. Reconciliation? There will be none of that. Besides, you're not to blame. 
Whether or not war was on the horizon, it would have come to this eventually. However, I am still to blame for your future being stolen from you. Is there nothing I can do to make amends, to put my mind at ease? If peace of mind is what you want, then allow me to strike down my father. Do what you will with me in the aftermath. But you must give me your word that my mother will be safe. Hmm. So it must be then. Moraga, you will do all within your power to assist Stern in defeating Elda. Uh, but, your, your holiness... It's not a request, I'm afraid. Do you understand? Yes, but Fordham isn't coming with us. They're staying right here. Stern and Stern alone joins us in the pursuit. Those are my terms. I see no problem with this. Oh, and Stern, I have a gift to give you later on. A gift? Yes, one that I believe will be well suited to your tastes. What are you... May the light of the crystals guide you.
Your plan worked without a hitch, Lord Mont. I never would have thought that we'd be the ones to lay an ambush. Neither would I. Fools! The both of you! Father... Engaging an enemy without first assessing the threat? You know better than that! Forgive me. However... There was no other way to keep the villagers out of harm's way. Please forgive his kindness, King Elda. Kindness, is it? That kindness will lead only to an early grave. Maybe it will. But this is the path I have chosen. I'll gladly give my life for the needs of the many. If that is the path you have chosen, then who am I to object? Father... But take heed, for you must never stray from it. You must always remain true to your conviction, no matter what. Show your enemies no mercy, even should they plead for their lives. One enemy shown mercy could bring Hellfire down upon this village. Understood? Yes, Father.
I am in a favorable mood today. I will show you something special. The essence of magic! Most of our foes have been taken care of. Now, let's finally depart this village. Hmm? A young maiden? You needn't worry, miss. Your village is safe now. We'll be out of your hair in no time. Actually, I wondered, might I join you? Join us? Sorry, but I think you'd be safer with other people. We've got Fennis hot on our trails right now. I will not be a burden, I swear it. You may call me mean, Will. Father, no. We mustn't drag any more innocent villagers into our war. You are headed for Wazette, are you not? We are. I could be your guide. I am well versed in the lay of this land. Why would you go to such lengths to help us? We almost threw your entire village to the wolves. I was moved by the way you have chosen to live your life, Lord Mont. That is why. Who, me? <laughs> then join him on his chosen path. Lead the way. Yes, Your Majesty. Please. Do follow me. Father?